what is the difference between bacterial vaginosis and aerobic vaginitis? So both bacterial vaginosis and aerobic vaginitis are caused by an overgrowth of disruptive bacteria in the vaginal microbiome. It's that simple. But with bacterial vaginosis, the disruptive bacteria are anaerobic. So an example of that is Gardnerella. With aerobic vaginitis, much like its name, the disruptive bacteria are aerobic bacteria, meaning that they need oxygen to survive. And an example of an aerobic bacteria is E. coli. With bacterial vaginosis, the primary symptoms you'll have are gray, thin, watery discharge, fishy odor, itching, burning, general discomfort. Some people don't have symptoms at all. Aerobic vaginitis will often give off like a foul, rotten smell, sticky, yellow-green discharge, pain with sex, and a lot of redness, burning, and swelling.